Fruitbunch AI has teamed up with Just Dig It, a Dutch regreening company in the AI for Trees challenge. Desertification is a huge problem in Africa, and empowering farmers there to bring back nature on their own lands holds enormous potential for cooling down the planet. But regreening is hard. You can't just dig around, plant some seeds here and there, and be done with it. To have a sense of the impact you're making, you need to monitor hectares and hectares of land for years. In this challenge, we'll use drone and satellite imagery. We get to work with RGB and multispectral images, as well as height maps to identify individual trees. I myself am a PhD student at the uh, Fair University in, in Amsterdam, and uh, I'm looking at uh, how to how to characterize vegetation from space. Through this project, I've come into contact with Just Dig It, and now uh, we're trying to work on a method to effectively count the number of trees from space, from drones, from aer aerial photography as well, but preferably from a regular open access product so we can monitor the progress of this project objectively without all of the sort of labor of sending people in to go into count at an extremely large region. And that's what we hope to achieve through this challenge as well. For one thing, the, the main thing of this of this project is that it's a uh, it's a measure of how successful these projects are. So of course, um, you know, planting trees and and better tree management and better environmental management projects are ongoing worldwide, and we want to know if they're working. Because of course, if they're not working, then there's no sense in pumping money and effort and and time into them. Uh, and this is a very robust, reliable method of checking whether this project uh, and many others like it. Uh, are working or not uh, and of course so if when this project succeeds and it shows that the project is working which we hope then we can great we can put more effort into this uh we can keep the project going for longer in the event that uh it shows that it's not working as well as we've hoped then there may be uh chances for reflection and opportunities to to make it work better and that's what we want we don't want to be doing something we don't want to be wasting our time we want to be doing something worthwhile and we want to make sure that we're doing something worthwhile for me personally, it would be a success when we can accurately determine the number of trees from space over a larger area. That would already be fantastic from my point of view. What's key, you know, as a scientist as well, it's really, really important to make sure all these projects, they have so much goodwill and so much energy behind them, but it's really key to make sure that the energy and goodwill is focused in the right way. Uh, hopefully without too much money and effort spent as well. So if we can develop something like this, then it's really uh, cost effective. Uh, and robust way of making sure that all that goodwill, all that energy and all that money is being put into a good use. And that's really the most important thing. We kick off on the 11th of July and together with AI engineers from all over the world, work until the 19th of September. There will be expert masterclasses to get you started and our project managers and data scientists will guide you start to finish. Sign up before the 8th of July if you're ready to take on this challenge with us. Experience in computer vision or GIS is welcome, but if you're willing to work hard, some basic Python knowledge is enough. See you there.